Welcome to 5 Minutes of Faith brought to you by Believer's Ministry where we're reaching the community with the love of Christ, one person, one family at a time. Join us as we are taking excerpts from our pastor's recent sermon. It's going to be about five minutes. The title of today's message is, The Wait is Over. Amen. Our lesson Amen. text will be taken from John the 5th chapter, verses 1 through 9 and verse 15. But our focus will be on verse 15 from the King James Version. And it reads, The man departed and told the Jews that it was Jesus which had made him whole. Mm -hmm. Today, we're going to be reminded about a miracle that took place at the pool of Bethesda. Everyone at some point in time will need, in their life, will need some kind of miracle. Mm -hmm. The good news is, our God is a God of miracles. Mm -hmm. The season for miracles is not over. Amen. Miracles are not reserved just for the days of the Bible. Mm -hmm. Miracles are still happening today. The Bible says in Hebrews 13, 8, that Jesus Christ is the same mm -hmm. yesterday today and forever yes. and if you have received the gift of salvation that's the greatest miracle you will ever receive Amen. everything that God does is a miracle to us yes. because it's done by his supernatural power it's something that we cannot do for ourselves so whatever you need today all you have to do is just believe it and receive it because the wait is over Amen. Our text tells us in verse 5 that a certain man had spent 38 years lying on a bed by this pool daily, waiting to be healed. Mm -hmm. He was an invalid. He had some form of paralysis. Then we're told that one day Jesus walked among the multitudes and saw this man lying there. And he knew how long this man had been in his condition. Now, Jesus saw this man differently than he saw himself. This man just saw himself sick in his body. Mm -hmm. But Jesus saw that he needed to be made whole, mm -hmm. spirit, soul, and body. Mm -hmm. He needed first and foremost to be healed spiritually. Mm -hmm. And so it is the same way with us. Yes. Jesus wants us to be whole, healed, spirit, soul, and body. Mm -hmm. Healed in our spirit. Healed in our emotions, mm -hmm. healed in our mind, healed in our body, total healing, spirit, soul, and body. Mm -hmm. The lame man acted on the word of God. He got up, took up his bed, and walked. His faith in God's word to get up brought him through to victory. Mm -hmm. This man now did not walk in his own strength. He walked in the power of God. Yes. And the scripture says immediately mm. the man yes. was made well. whole. When Jesus speaks, Amen. things change. Amen. There's power in the word of God. Yes. Hebrews 4.12 yes. tells us that God's word is alive mm. and it's full of power. Yes. There's healing in the word of God. Yes. Psalm 107 yes. verse 20 says he sent his word mm. and he healed them. Mm. Whatever we need mm. is in the word of God. Well, God is saying to us, say get up. Take yes. up your bed and walk. Yes. But before we can stand, we have to get up. Mm -hmm. We must be willing mm -hmm. to get up from where we are and take up our bed. Take up that situation. Yes. Take up yes. that yes. circumstance. Yes. Take up that attitude. Take up whatever is holding us back. Take up whatever is keeping you down. Yes. Get up and walk in obedience to the word well, of God. Yes. Hallelujah. Bless the word of the name of Jesus. Yes. Time out. Yes. The wait is over. Faith and obedience bring God on the scene. Yes. If we will make the effort mm. to act on God's word, God's power will meet our effort yes. and take over well, from there. Amen. Just amen. God knows what's best for us. Yes. He knows all things yes. and he makes no mistakes. Yes. And God is working all the time. Mm. He's behind the mm. scenes orchestrating everything. Yes. Remember, yes. when you are born again, believer, God causes all things to work together yes. for good yes. to yes. those of us who love God yes. and are called according to his purpose. Yes. It doesn't matter how bad things yes. seem sometimes. Well, it doesn't matter how hopeless things seem sometimes. Yes. God had turned that situation around, yes. working for our good 
character. Yeah. And we know yeah. that Jesus. one of the things that he does, he's making our character. Yeah. Character is the sum total of our habits. Mm -hmm. Making our character mm -hmm. so we can be a stronger mm -hmm. witness yeah. for him. Mm -hmm. Just release your faith in Jesus and tell the Lord that you need his help right now. And make up your mind today that you need Jesus to help you. Don't leave here the same way you came. Mm -hmm. Get up from that situation. Get up from that broken relationship. Get up from that disappointment. Get up from the hurt. Get up from that pain. Get up from those circumstances. Come to Jesus to be made whole to receive your miracle because the wait is over. We trust that the word has encouraged you, has impacted your life, and we'd like to extend a cordial invitation to come out and join us in service. Our address is 465 Waterbury Court, Suite E, Gehanna, Ohio, 43230.